Sometimes, ladies and gentlemen, you need to have a laid back, relaxed episode. Sometimes you need fast paced moving acceleration. We're going with option one today. Are you ready? What is up, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to the next episode of the Rag to Ridges series. Hope everyone's doing good today. Hope you're all having a fantastic day. We decided to do something a little different today. You're going to probably notice right off the bat, if you are watching the live stream, that we are a little bit low on rubles. We actually made some about, about 2 million rubles during the live stream. It was, it was a pretty good one. But uh, I want to do something a little different. Because people are always asking me, how do you make this money here? How do you do this run here? I really need some money, man. I'm really low on money. I need money, 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 money. Well, let me show you something. It's going to cost you a little bit, but it's a good investment. Today, we're going out with this key card right here. 21 WS key, which is about close to 450, 500,000. You get 15 uses out of it, but typically you get some really nice stuff out of it. So, we're going to see what we can make today. I spent 450. That was our first initial cost price. And we'll see exactly what we can get out of that room. Uh, well, container. It's not really a room. It's more of a container. On top of that, everything else that we get from the stash runs. So, without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, Let's head over to and change, and let's have a relaxing, good old time. Are you ready? Hey, we're in. We actually got a good spawn for this. Hope you guys are all having a fan flippantastic Monday. Let's do this. It's, it's a Monday, you know. It's, it's, it's most people find Mondays is like the lazy day. They're they're not quite up and and wake yet, trying to get their feet from dragging off the ground all the time. So I figure we start off the week a little bit more easy, a little more relaxing. Quick stash runs. Plus that and to be honest with it, I didn't feel like tasking today. <laughs> so there came to that as well. Uh a gun. Okay, one five. Uh, let's take a look. Is there anyone coming our way? Surprisingly getting really good frames right now, and it's it's very strange to me. <laughs> I don't see anything though. Put to keep an eye out, see if the power actually gets turned on, and it is not yet, so we will not be able to use the key card just yet. Did he go in there? I don't think he went in there. Yeah. Got him. I think we're okay. Well, that was a little interesting. Didn't expect that. But that's why we bring this gun. It's a bolt action, so it also works on our sniper skill. Bonus. Just a bonus. I heard I heard wood to my left, so I'm like, okay, there's definitely someone close by. Turned out to be these guys. What'd you end up finding? Drop it. He's got some decent ammo in there. It sounds like Killa's here. <laughs> I think Killa may be on the map. But that's not our objective, so we're not really worried about it. I don't think the power is going to get turned on, sadly. Oh, we're using PS ammo. Why the heck are you using PS ammo? That's strange. 
you can still get some pretty decent ammo for 545. Even BP is better than PS. Weird, man. Just strange. Well, not what I was expecting. These guys must be a little. They're definitely new because they're using PS rounds in there, too. Brought me lunch. Dope. Looks like he hit the other stash up too. Gives me a little bit of an indicator where I can go, where I should go. Yeah, we're not gonna stick around for that power, but we'll definitely get turned on sooner, sooner or later. So we'll just kind of skirt around the mall, see what kind of loot we can get. Do, 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 do. Keep working on the sniper skill. It all works out in the end. Speaking of which, I think I'm going to have to chill for a moment. This is what we're going to do, actually. One, two, and three. Wait, what do you got on you? Drop the light bulb. Take that. I, I was going to stack the backpack, but like honestly, I'm so over capacity right now it's not even funny let's take this drop that take this and then we can toss the food down here cool 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 cool, cool. so we got four five and oh i guess that's it do, 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 do. oh just saw somebody Somebody's over there. You brought me lunch? Man, they're just bringing me lunch for days. Uh, I'm going to go inside here for just a moment. Pretty sure I saw somebody. Lay down. Lay down. Lay down. I guess I can't do it from this angle. Definitely saw someone in there. Also, this isn't the worst strategy in the world to uh, eliminate the players before going in. That we don't have to worry about them if you know if we were to go, you know, we're, if we were to be going in. There's people fighting in there. Let's keep going. Do 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 do. Sorry, music in my head's coming coming in hard. <laughs> Alright, no power still. I'll probably use that strategy a few times because this isn't too bad of an idea. To try to take out players. SV SV ninety eight is actually pretty strong. All things considered. for a minute. But that bus is open. Let's get our strength back real quick. I love how steady this is right now. I don't see anyone though. Hmm. Get a little more stamina back. Only the ones either somebody's looting or uh, they're still hiding. Either way, we're still gonna work on our stashes. <laughs> 
Keep on going, keep on going. What you got for us, huh? We're looking for anything and everything all the time. Ooh, all right. Why don't we enjoy some quick lunch? Some peas. Just a scab. Do, 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 do. I need to check these guys more often though for the key cards and stuff. I will be able to forgive myself if I end up actually finding out there's a key card in one of these guys' pockets. No, oh, you didn't have anything. Keep on moving. Uh, but the reason why that key card is so good, I should kind of go over that. So, whenever the key card's turned on, that crate is just in that little compound that we were next to. We shot the first dude originally. Now, once you get into that compound, or when you get into the compound, you get up to the crate, it's got a ton of different loot spawns inside. You can get, like, armor, you get really good weapon attachments. It's all around a very good little crate to get. Now, when the, when the key's like a mill, you can still, technically speaking, profit from it. But I would recommend waiting to the keys to about close to like four fifty, five hundred thousand, like we did. Cause that way you're only having to wait like, let's just say, five uh, five runs of this to actually profit back from it. Um, versus like you know the ten runs plus only getting five proper runs. Ooh, someone's been through here. Oh, all right. Is the culprit still here? Keep an eye out for him. So yeah, uh, that's what I would recommend. Usually, like about like three, or two or three months from now, the key card price will go from where it's at now to pretty much low. I'm gonna guess they probably checked the one before going into the mall. Well, hello there, car battery. How are you today? <laughs> I guess I can take you. Can we find something else? Work on that strength. Bruh. But yeah, it'll probably go down to like one, 150. It won't really rise after that, after about two or three months. Most people are focused on other loot. But no, then again, the way that this wipe is, it may change a little bit. We'll have to see. It's already more profitable than that one item. So we're, oh, we're going to take that. It really the battery. We don't need it. It's just a heavy thing for us to carry, but we can get enough strength training as it is. Thought I heard something to my right. Uh, I sent a message off to the devs, and they said that they may have a fix for me to get my grass back on energy. So, looking forward to hearing that, because that will be very nice to <laughs> figure that one out. Because I hate the fact that I don't have my grass. Gun? Yeah, it's a gun. So hopefully that will be a nice little informatio they can send me and we can get this thing fixed. Keep going, keep, keep going. But until then, you know, we've got to kind of go with it. Oh, oh, come on. But yeah, I really just wanted to get like a nice, nice episode in from stashes and relax and have a grand old time together. Another pistol. Well, I am a little thirsty. We'll take that. And actually, these are full of PS rounds, so I don't need them. So we'll just take the helmet, too. Keep on going. Almost out. We're actually not getting any more uh, stamina back, so we'll just walk it. We'll walk it to the exit. Watch out for players and snipe if we have to. 
a little bit of a uh, a treat for us because like i said i was not expecting to get a uh, a kill like that but i'll take it two kills like that i should say it wasn't just the one it was the two i'm surprised though the guy on the left didn't push up on me then again i don't think they actually knew where i was they were pretty confused for a minute everything seems pretty good no extract camper. All right, sweet. We'll take our little mini one. Still getting a profit pretty good from all the stuff. Um, yeah, I like it. Just so we can get as many runs as impossible, I'm going to just literally just jump right back into the next raid. So I'll see you guys in a second. All right. Hey, we spawned in again. Same exact spot. Let's see. This time, if maybe we'll get the uh, power turn on for us. I'm going to quickly loot this real quick. That's right here. Okay. Quickly, quickly. So many. The reason why I'm saying quickly is because there's a spawner right in front of us. I don't see anyone. Uh, we look clear, but it doesn't mean that there's actually no one there, so I'll keep an eye out. Obviously, last time we just literally went right for this direction, we found the people, but we're keeping an eye out. Relay matches. Take them. Take what we can. Power is still off. I really do hope someone turns, turns the power on. If they don't turn the power on, I'm going to go do it myself. Because I... I want to be able to show you guys this thing. And if it's going to be continually turned off, well, that's not going to help us out. Now, is it? Check and see if I see any people's heads popping up. Looks clear. All right then. <laughs> Almost for days, apparently. Sorry, I get paranoid because people like to like sit in between. Think we're okay though. Yeah, I think we're okay. Keep an eye on it. Unfortunately, sometimes this is how it goes. You know, you, you get sometimes where the power gets turned on all the time on on uh, interchange. Sometimes it never gets turned on. So we'll hope it does. If it doesn't, we'll just get it for the next run. We'll at least get it for the next time. Till then, grab our loot, grab what we can. So tomorrow, guys, maybe even today, if I if I am up to it, we'll see if, if what time this video comes out, what time I wake up. <laughs> um, we'll probably have, or we're gonna have another live stream. Um, definitely for Tuesday's live stream, we got scav runs that we're gonna doing. We're gonna be doing with our uh, subscribers. Uh, so make sure that you are subscribed to the channel. So if you want to play some games, come on over and we'll have a good old time. Because uh, I've been wanting to get some interaction with you guys for a while, so that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna have some fun playing some scav runs. Basically, I'll do a PMC run, then when the scav is ready, I'll pull you guys in. We'll we'll do some we'll do some games together. Ooh, very nice. Power is still off. No. No big deal. That's how it goes sometimes, right? At the end of this episode, we'll go through everything and we'll uh we'll sell it all off and see how much money we make. Watch out for anybody coming our direction. Now this run sometimes gets skewed. Obviously, we killed two players, so. That a that adds a little bit of difference into our, our plan of what we're actually gonna be uh, we would have actually made what we wouldn't have actually made so but 
Hey, you gotta add for, you know, you, you gotta look for variables in those type of situations. Nice, getting some good money items right now. And honestly, other than Killa, I don't have anything in interchange I actually have to work on. Which is weird to say. That is very odd for me to actually say. Like, the only thing to do here now is just to shoot Killa. I guess, technically speaking, we could go here for, like, the... Like, the cloths and stuff. Because we need, like, the like the fleece and all that. The fabrics. That's the word I was saying, the fabrics. But beyond that, we really have no reason to be at interchange anymore. Other than have a little bit of fun, doing some stash runs. That's why I like to do these. Nice, relaxing. I can talk with you guys, get some information, information and everything. Uh, I would look for the end of this week. If you're interested in, in seeing the next uh, Ultra Hardcore, I know a lot of you are. Um, it's going to be at the end of this week. I'm still finishing up the editing, getting some uh, some some things tweaked. Uh, how I want to start a little bit of editing for those, those series. So keep an eye out. It's coming out. I'm just doing a bit of editing. Oh, you're on the other side. Where's the last one? What on? All right, we got. Him. Just gonna quickly check to see if these guys got anything on them. Give me that. Nothing, okay. Surprising that you didn't have it. It didn't actually have a uh, flashlight on that gun. It's all mags. Okay. All right, keep going. Yeah. So either two uh, two things are going to have to happen. One, you got to hope there's a team going for like Kiba and getting all the loot from that, or going for like the Ultra Medical Key. Those are uh, those are the only two that I could really see people turning on the power for. So if they don't turn the if they don't turn the power on, we're going to have to go do it ourselves. Which means we're going to have to either spawn right at the power station or just get you know. Get our little butts running and out run. We'll have to get get over there ourselves. Just by golly, I want to get in that gosh darn container. And we're gonna get in there. Toilet paper. I'm good. I have enough at home. We just got a little bit of action at the beginning. I'm sure we're gonna run some more people. It happens. Dense milk, huh? Just with a doctor ordered. Nice. I have a feeling probably, I want to say in a week, we're probably going to hit level 42. We're getting to that point. We're almost going to be maxed out with all the traders, which is going to be very nice for us. And the next step after that, well, I may slowly start stepping away from tasks and just focus on, like, gunplay in a sense. So watch out for that. Um, I want to hear your opinions in the chat, though. Would you like to see us continue more tasks over and over and over? Or just, like, would you like to see us go into more raids and see what kind of items we can find just getting into combat? You let me know in the, in the chat. Uh, obviously, we're still trying to get the hideout maxed out. So that's the biggest influence that I'm, I'm having right now that we're working towards. So, yeah, but let me know, though. I'm always curious. Curiosity never killed the cat, right? Huh? Oh, did? Oh. Awkward. Um. The diary is expensive. Cola. We'll drink you. Good 
Good enough. Take that. Check the last one, then we're outie. That power never got turned on. Ten minutes into the raid, never got turned on. Oh, come on. I'm gonna guess. Oh, let's see, is it a gun? Nope, just another helmet. <laughs> we're getting a lot of helmets today, it seems like. A lot of them. And honestly, I don't really need any more helmets. Uh, we've gone through a lot. Uh, drop that. Maybe these things are pretty expensive. Then we'll drop all of our, our medic stuff. Do this and do that. Something like that. Good enough. All right. Same plan. We're going to get to the exit. Exit away. And then I'll be back in here for another run. Another run to see if we can get inside the container. Because I know there's some of you, or actually a lot of you that are new that want to see what's inside that container. And I'm going to show you. Is it right to turn the power on on myself or not? Let's just live so I can actually show you. Live! Do not die! Alright. We'll see you in a moment. Alrighty. We're in. Alright, this is not too bad of a spawn. Ooh, you know what? Let's go to the left with the, uh... Get the stash over here. And then hopefully someone turns the power on. This is definitely the worst one to have to go turn the power on, though. So we, we're probably not going to do it if it doesn't get turned on. But if it's falling closer to power, we'll go do over there. Come on. What you got for us? Ooh, more water filters. And another pistol. I feel like you get a lot of weapons in these runs. A lot of weapons in, in gear lately. This thing is set to 100. There we go. See if anyone's crossing over. Mm, nothing yet. I'll head over towards the sign. Just wait. Possibly people will continue heading out. Please, turn on the power. Turn on the power, please. What the heck was that noise? Someone popping a shot over towards us? Check the stashes real quick, see if anyone's going for them. Looks clear, but as we don't know, all know, looks are deceiving sometimes. Uh, nothing yet. I heard something over here. What was that sound? Hmm? Someone sneak it up on us? Hmm. Maybe not. Alright, no power for us. Sadly. Alright, next raid, no matter what, we're turning on the power. No matter what. We just didn't get a... We got a horrible spawn for it this time. The money. All right, this is the money one. And yeah, we'll sell it all. Sell it all. It's unfortunate how many times the power is. This is like the well, we had a fourth raid, but I had to redact that one for many, many reasons. There was a lot of words that were slurred from a, a, a PMC that we ran into, and that man's words were not. Not very uh, pleasant, so I couldn't use him. Sadly, it was actually a pretty good raid, but 
I had to redact it. Even with editing, it would have been horrible. There's a lot of yelling back and forth, basically. Hey, don't say those words. Those are bad words. A helmet and some nails. Okay. I'm just constantly checking it just in case. Do, 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 do. Check the stash here. What do you got for us? Another rig, some coffee, this, that, all damn good things. All right. Well, I shouldn't say all good things. They weren't all good items, but I'll take it. Wow, I'm putting it in the bag. Keep on going, keep on going. I'm always curious, and if people aren't turning on the power, then what are they going for? Just literally the tech loot? I mean, that's my guess is what they'll be going for. But that's all you're going for, man. I don't think people understand the type of loot that you can get from Mana Change. Like, the tech loot is just a very minimum part of it. Like the tech, the tech stores, like the three of them. Obviously, people really want that, but there's a lot of different type of loot they can get in this map, and it's all all good money. That's why I really like this map because of all the diversity of what you can do. Okay. Gonna triple check. Oh, power still off. Means we'll just get a little bit more loot and then get out. But luckily, we spawn pretty close to the exit, so doesn't make it make it a painful like walk around looting and everything. But this is a looting episode, so I guess technically speaking, it's a good thing. The more loot, the better. Okay, that's a ring. Let's see here. Oh, uh, yeah, let's see. Just toss all this in there. Okay. Oh, uh, so many of the little small items. Good, 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 good. Look at that. It literally fit all of them in there. Check the stash over here. I'm honestly contemplating on bringing a bigger bigger rig next time. May have to actually. Got shooting going on. All right, my shooting's not that bad. Or maybe it is. <laughs> maybe it is that bad. Holy cow. It's leading it pretty good. Although there are also people that do camp the power. I just thought about that. There's some people that will literally wait outside the map the whole time waiting for somebody to possibly come turn on the power because they know like that extra loot is hidden behind the behind the power. Though that actually would not surprise me if someone was doing that. Take it, take it, take it, take it, take it, take it, take it. Check the other stash over here. Visor. E fuel. Okay. Emercom. The wink a dink or an extra Emercom. All right, it was a busted run, sadly. Busted run, no power. No matter what, we're going for that power next raid. Oh, hi. Hey, 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 hey. Extra campers. It's a thing. <laughs> uh, getting 
guess I got Magnum bucked. Yep. <laughs> you gotta love these extract campers, man. That means we can switch up our strategy a little bit. Let's go to prepper real quick. Equip, 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 and equip. Very nice, very nice. Um, that should be good. I think for now, we'll just bring in a Mosin. Yeah, we don't need we don't need to bring anything crazy in. Good there. Grab some health real quick. This one. And therapist. Let's grab this. And grab that. Perfect. Over this time we don't run to an extract camper with Magnum Buckshot. But we'll see. We'll see what happens. Um, I think I'm happy with this. Ooh, hold on, let's take this off. That was in the wow, really? That yeah, that was okay. That was interesting. That was inside the insurance. Ah. Okay. Wait, was there anything else inside this one? Even the ULAC was there. Nice. All right. Well, there's that. All right. Let's head over back to interchange. And again, we're turning on the power no matter what. Let's do this. Okie dokie. We're in again. We got the same exact spawns last time on this. So. Hey, we'll see what happens. Let's set to 100. And uh, like I said, if we have to turn the power on, I will definitely do that. today and I'm gonna to be triple checking that spotting uh, this time her freaking spawn camper <laughs> or sorry exit camper excuse me this is not Call of Duty not spawn camping exit camping camping there's a, there's a difference there's definitely a difference good chill Did you see anyone running across the parking lot Oh, power got turned on. Never mind, we're good. Here we go. We finally get to go check it out. Unfortunate to lose stuff to exit campers, but hey, what are you gonna do? You know, that's how the game goes. People have their own styles. There's literally a guy that does nothing but exit camping, so or ex extract camping, so hey. To each the own, right? All right, these stashes are kind of lame. All right, so we head over here. Did I load this up? I did, okay. I wanted to make sure I actually did. I'm gonna come over here, jump this, jump this. Swipe the card, beep, bop, boop. Opens up. There we go. Let me loot away. Not the best loot today. This rate, at least. Let's hope we get some uh, better stuff for inside the crates. A weapon. MDR. Ooh, all right. More attachments. Okay, nice, nice. Let's toss that one right on there, make a little more room. Same thing, just toss it right on there. Nice, okay, cool. But yeah. There's a lot of times I found some really nice stuff in there. You kind of shoot for like 100,000 every single run. As a minimum. That's what you're hoping for. Doesn't always happen. But you hope for it. Okay, 
I'm gonna skip the one on my right. We'll go straight to this one here. Actually, you know. Is right? No, it's right here. Okay. I got turned around there for a minute. Let's check ahead, make sure no one's coming. Okay. Give us some loot. We need the loot. Another rig. I guess for now, what we could do, just take it. Fill her up. Just like that. All right. It's a chest ring. It gives money, you know. And if we got the space, we might as well take it. Blood said oatmeal. You're not gonna become rich off these runs, but you'll make a pretty decent price, uh, decent little chunk of money. What else you got for us? My half mask. You found it. Been looking for that thing. All right, cool. Now we can eat the oats. Wait, did I pass the other one without looking at it? There's no way. I actually looked at this one, right? I'm doubting myself, ladies and gentlemen. I almost forgot if I even looked at this one. I'm pretty sure I did. Yes, because I looked in this direction. I'm losing it. <laughs> Truly almost forgot whether I looked in that stash or not. Well then. There goes the brain for the night. <laughs> Let's keep going. A few more stashes to go and we're out. Nothing that I can see. Should be clear. I really like looking for underneath um, to see if anyone's coming out from the, from the hole in the wall. That's typically what I have to watch out for. And then I do usually check to see if I see anyone's head popping up on, on top of there. Those are the two spots I look. Grant, you do have the other way people can be coming from here too. If they're really paranoid and go all the way around. Got some cores, some rubles. God, I was saying, I thought that maybe that was gonna be a gun. Pairing. Can screw nuts. Alright. Keep on going. Looking on the tables. Okay. We're gonna go check the last stash over here in the box and then we'll call it goon. Call it Gucci. Nothing else. If we really wanted to do a giant you know, lap all the way around the map and do all the stashes, we could, technically speaking. But I feel like to do that, you have to get a really good spawn. Like, the best spawn to do that, I feel like, would be the power station. Then you could truly, like, wrap around and do all the, the stashes. Give us the loot. Give us the loot. There's the pistol. I was like, wait a minute, Tarkov. Something's going wrong here. You're not giving us a pistol this room. Oh, someone's checked that one. All right, fair enough. Yes, I'm that paranoid that I'm going to check that exit again. This guy was like sitting in a bush right here. He was sitting right here. I 
Looks clear this time. We don't have to worry about extra campers. Nice. All right. I'll see you guys in the next one. Either Tarka's being like super nice to us or we're just getting really lucky with the spawns. And we seem to get this one or the one along, along the road right next to the, uh, the container every time. Interesting. I can say that at least. Very interesting. Well, loot up a little bit. See if we can get our chances to get in there again. If we, uh, if we can. Awesome. If not. All right then. Shooting already. Get a quick look down the road. See if I see anything. Nothing. Check the power. Power still off. A little early. Keep continuing down. Like I said, we will check the power if we have to. I will make sure we get the loot in there. No matter what. What's up with all these hats, man? I'm just... I'm... <laughs> <laughs> More hats. <laughs> More gosh darn hats. What do I need those for? Well, I mean, we got fashion, at least. We're, we're looking fashioning. We're fashion fashionable, at least. Oh, we're still off. Hopefully we find some other things other than face shields and, and you know, hats. Yeah, all right, that's a little better. We'll start with that. We'll start with that. All right. Getting close to where I'm going to decide to go. Yeah, I think we're going to check these two stashes and then we're going to go for the, the power. That's going to be the plan. It sounded like it was thrown from outside. I could be wrong. Huh, that was weird. Who threw that? Huh? Who's throwing stuff at me? All right, I'm just going to say maybe that was just a, a bug. And that no one actually threw anything at us. Drop that. Right now, I'm kind of convinced someone's in there. Or someone's just a really bad shot. Because <laughs> now you're shooting in the front of the mall. Maybe someone's just a really bad shot. some lunch all right let's go turn on the power shall we
All right. Power is still off. Checking some some loots. Okay. All right. Now we go back to the uh, the container. Okay, we're over here now. <laughs> Let's get the loot. Yeah, well we can. Ooh, we got trooper armor. We got trooper armor, ladies and gentlemen. Grab all the miscellaneous real quick. All right, we gotta do a couple things here. Get rid of those two. And actually get rid of this. Trooper armor. We can get this. What kind of barrel? M uh, 22 is actually not bad. I'm gonna take that. Let's say AR 15. We're full, but we can always exchange parts if need be. Okay, I'm not quite sure yet. We'll eat some lunch then for just a moment. Actually, we can drop that. I'm not going to keep that. We got a lot of stuff in here. Two weapons. Look at that. Two weapons already. Um, I don't think I need any of this stuff. But we'll do this. And then... I'll take that. Not the most, not the worst. We'll take it. We'll take what we can. Now we get to the answer. Getting that time of the day where I really enjoy it because it's like, it's just slowly becoming dusk and I like it. I don't know why. It just gives the map really something nice. Is that? Okay. Wow. I must be losing it or that shadow looked like a person. Maybe you guys agree with me on that one because it looked like a shadow. <laughs> Nothing. Keep her going. Keep her going. We may have time for one more raid after this. One more. We'll see if we can get the rest of what we're looking for. Which is just loot. <laughs> and then we'll call it good. But we gotta survive first. We gotta live. All right, that's right. We already looted everything over here, so we're just literally heading right to the exit. Literally to the exit, man. So far, nothing. Although, for the, probably in tomorrow's episode, my thinking is, I I may. I may go for some more lighthouse kills, gonna have to, because I have to finish up some rogue kills and then somehow get ourselves inside of the base. Now it's gonna be difficult because, well, it's lighthouse, so it's inherently difficult for like the rogue area. But at some point it's gonna get done. On the other flip side, though, I would like to try to go for the Lenex. So I'll I'll figure it out in between. Most likely, though, I'm probably gonna go for the Lenex. Is what I'm thinking. Just because it's part of like a you know a task that we need to do. Layers. Yeah, I don't know what he's doing. Check the bush just in case. down watch out for anybody all right we're fine all right let's hit the last rig oh hey we actually didn't uh pass up every single stash <laughs> nice all right well let's uh let's do a little bit of looting shall we what you got oh i forgot to refill the water luckily we're doing stash runs which means we have a high chance of finding some type of drink so hey there's that 
Loot up the stashes. Loot them all. Loot them all. What you got for me? What you got for me? Ooh, a skull. Actually, I think I can go in the sick case again. Nice. I actually gotta start holding under those. Gap case is coming up. We need six of those, and then we need a bunch of other loot too, so. There's that. Hit up the rest of the stashes. Let's see if someone's turned the power on. No power yet. Don't make me run all the way over there, okay? That's a long run. I'm going to be honest with you, okay? That, that, that's that's a very long run. <laughs> Don't make me do it. Just be nice and actually turn it on, okay? Please. Watch out for anybody. Start, still heading over towards the middle. Doesn't seem like it. Keep checking it. I will go over there and turn it on if I have to. If it's the last gosh darn thing I do, I'll turn that power on, eh? Okay. Whoa! Sliding past it. A manual. Nice. Alright. Um, just to save myself a headache of a long run, I'm going to go turn that power on real quick. And just like that, the power's on. Voodoo magic, I know. I know, it's voodoo magic. I think I actually did just one tap him. Oh crap, I did. <laughs> All right. All rows, ooh, sure, 12. Always use more of those. All right, buddy. What you got on you? Are you an actual player? X Phil Skinwalker. This guy probably would have tried to kill us at the end. We survived because we killed the man, all right? Don't look at me like that, okay? We survived because we killed him. <laughs> well, let's see what else you got on you. M80, huh? Glock mags. A lot of Glock mags, dude. Holy cow. Ooh, thermite. Alright, let's go open this thing up. What treasures you got for us today? Hopefully some good ones. Swipe it! Swiping down, not swiping left or right, but swiping downward. Okay, cool one. G28? Oh! Cylinder... Okay, nothing too crazy this time. As always, we take our lunchbox. Good way to actually stock up on lunchboxes now I think about that. It's a very good way to do it. Okay, I'll take that piece. Take the mo, the mo, mo, mo. Uh, gun, maybe? Yeah, the gun. Do, 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 do. Cool, we made it. Alright, let's start the rest of the run. And we'll call it good. Not bad, not bad at all. Now I was hoping for for that run, but hey, you know, you don't always get everything that you want with these these uh, container runs. You know, sometimes they're completely full of items. And sometimes there's just nothing. Alright, you died. Someone take the rest of our loot while I was doing things. Son of a gun. We have to go find our thief. Thief, I say, thief. Mm 
nearly full. Interesting. Okay. Ooh, hot rod. Delicious. Delicious. Make sure not fully zoomed in when try to go shoot somebody. Alright. What will we find in the last few stashes? Anything good? I do hope so. Either way, we made a decent amount of money today. Doesn't look like it, but after we sell everything, it's quite a bit. All these guns and everything. Yeah, it's pretty good. Andrew, no thank you. few stashes. Ooh, morphine. Normally I put the injector case put it in the injector case, but we uh we don't have that many items right now. And I'm actually okay with where we're at. Um because we also don't have any more room in the stash. <laughs> I liked it that on the last run and I'm like oh we are completely full up. I have no way to put like a full size rifle in there. Like these will be fine because you know they're they're just a single row, not two. No, it's not a double wide, so. Uh. Oh. Oh, you were dealing with that. I'm so sorry. I have an idea where he's at. Or I don't actually. Keep a listen out. George! Down before I get sniped. Because I think I just saw him. Nice. And we completed a task. What the heck? <laughs> I didn't think those guys were going to count. Why did the bolt action count? It said, I'm pretty sure it said Mosin. Interesting. I did not expect that. Honestly, I didn't like.
Hey, either way, I'll take it. I'll take the win. Well, that's another Tarkov shooter done. I think we get level four sniper from that too. Let's go turn it in real quick. Oh. Eliminate Sanitar. Oh, okay. I'll keep an eye out for him. Uh, Tarkov shooter part three, that's finished. Part four, what do I got? To, oh. Okay. Part five. We need to eliminate scabs using a bolt action rifle between the period of 2100 and 5. I can do that easily. We just have to bring some night vision. We got this. It's a lot of tasks to do. I'm not showing you the mechanic one, obviously. Uh, let's go to character skills. We're almost 40, guys. We're almost there. Very, very close. Yeah, we got a lot of loot too from that last one. All right, let's get it all dropped off, dropped off, dropped off, shall we? All right, let's turn off. Oh, I have no room. All right, we need to start selling. <laughs> let's let's get some stuff sold because obviously we have no room. These dog tags actually need to go up here. You know what? No, we're gonna we're going over our time. We're gonna leave this for a stash cleanup. Because obviously, we have a lot of time for that. And this is a lot of items. So we're going to leave this for a stash cleanup, plus a couple other things I have in store for those stash cleanups. So, with that, ladies and gentlemen, that's going to be the end of the episode. And as always, hope you enjoyed the episode. This key is going to come in handy for different runs when we go to interchange. And just for fun. It's really nice. Gives you nice money. And I want to show you guys the, you know, the key and show you exactly what it's all about. Because not everyone's seen it. And it's a, you know, it's a good time to show them. What was the rewards from all that? I think it's like a bunch of little small things. Oh, yeah, it is. A bunch of money, too. Well, we definitely profited today, either way. So, ladies and gentlemen, if you enjoyed today's video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below what you enjoyed about the episode, what you're excited about for the future. I gotta get this thing edited because it's super late. And I'll see you in the next one. <laughs>